President Bolati Numbo in his May 29, 2023 inauguration speech says his administration will create agricultural hubs throughout the nation to increase food production and engage in value-added processing. Earlier on our flagship show, Business Nigeria, Dr. Matthew Ojo, a researcher and agribusiness economist, spoke on ways to improve productivity and address food insecurity across the country. Unless we move our, our production to that mechanized state where we produce in large scale, there's no way we can really feed ourselves as a nation. Now, the picture is such that you have about, okay, up to 70% or more than 70% of the populace involved in agriculture, and we can feed ourselves. In other climes, you have just about 5%, okay, of the populace, I mean, involved in agriculture, they are feeding themselves and they are exporting. The secret is technology mechanization. So how do we bring this on? It has to do with commitment. So we can move to mechanization. How I think we can is to, for, for first of all, the incoming uh, Minister for Agriculture. First of all, I've said that that ministry should not be used as a compensation ministry. It should be, be, they should look for someone who is capable, who can answer the question of why are we hungry in Nigeria? Why are we food poor in Nigeria? So when you have a, a, the head, okay, galvanizing commissioners, like you can look at each state, look at their particular situation and find a way of where you can inject mechanization into the particular food crop they have comparative advantage of producing. Asian shares extended a global rally today on optimism that the Federal Reserves would pause its rate hikes this month after a mixed U.S. job reports when all jumped out about Saudi Arabia pledged to big output courts in July. Japan's nickel surged 1% to a 33-year high. Australian resources heavy shares gained 1%. South Korea Kospi rose 0.5%. S&P 500 features dipped 0.1%. Nasdaq features dropped 0.3% in Asian hours after a strong rally on Friday driven by mixed U.S. job reports, a resolution to the debt ceiling issue and the prospects of U.S. rate pause this month. While the Dow Jones gained 2%. In the monetary market, dollar gained 0.5% and stayed elevated. At 104.16, greenback jumped 0.8% on Japanese yuan to 139.94, while the euro eased 0.5% to $1.07.